This is Chuck Parker from Automotive Digest. We're here at uh, Dealer.com's headquarters. Kevin Root is the Chief Product Officer, CPO of Dealer.com. And today we're going to talk about social media, about reputation management, about the complete impact of a study that Kevin and a team of researchers put together and seek to figure out a way to translate the meaning and the implications of this study into actionable things at the dealer level. Are we moving towards a you know, purchase the vehicle online state? Um, you know, I think it, in many regards we're already there. I think the technology is there to facilitate that. But I'm not sure that um, the widespread desire is there. Yeah. Now here's why. One of the things that we found in our study was that um, consumers, while they said social media is, is very important and helpful in determining what vehicle to buy, the number one most important thing to determine what to buy still comes down to interacting with that product at the dealership. 91% of them said, you know what, I still have to go touch that car, I gotta feel it, I gotta drive it, and yeah, I wanna look in the eyes of the guy that's behind this transaction, right? So, you know, in many regards, there's lots of change in our industry, but some of the basics still hold true, okay? So that's important. The role of the salesperson, is it changing? Absolutely. You know, any business has to evolve when the customer set or when the marketplace around them is evolving. Dealers are doing that, and they're doing that in a really good way right now. I think that uh, the dealers that are trying to hold on to the old traditional methods of selling a car are, are increasingly sort of being left in the dust. Um, that's not to say that some of the basics don't hold true, as I said. But yes, for sure, I think salespeople are evolving, and I think dealerships are doing a great job of evolving as well.